Hi there, it's Krista, a former US visa officer here to talk to you about preparing for the H-1B visa interview. The first thing I wanna say is that we often get contacted by H-1B visa applicants who end up in administrative processing and they don't know what to do, they don't know how to move forward and they want advice from a former visa officer about their next steps. This video is meant to help people avoid administrative processing altogether. And if you're nervous or you're not sure about the advice given in this video, my number one piece of advice is to get an Argo consultation and get ready for your H-1B visa interview. So the first thing that you want to make sure for your H-1B visa interview is that you know the job you're being offered. If the visa officer asks you, uh, what are you going to be doing? What's your title? How are you qualified for this position? Questions like that. You have got to be spot on in your answers. It's almost like you're going to a job interview, right? When If you go to a job interview, you're thinking of examples you can give, explaining a little bit, really presenting credibly and professionally in a way that the hiring manager is going to see, okay, this person can do this job. Kind of think in that mindset for the H-1B visa interview. Then you want to know a little bit as well about the company. If you have no idea the name of your hiring manager, the name of the company, where it's located, you know, you might have some problems with your visa interview. Get to know a little bit the company before going to the visa interview and be able to speak credibly about the service or product that the company provides and how the work that you're going to be doing is going to support that service or product. Finally, you want to make sure that you are really highlighting your credentials as a student, what your background is. The H-1B visa is for professionals. So if it doesn't make sense what you've studied with what you're going to be doing, you might have difficulties at the visa interview. So try to connect what you've studied with what you're actually going to be doing at the visa interview. And nowadays, a lot of visa applicants get stuck in 221G process processing because they're going to the U.S. to do an entirely remote job. If you're going for a remote job, you need to get prepared to speak about why you need to be in the United States. If the job is remote, why can't it be done from your home country? Why do you need to be in the United States? Having a coherent, reasonable explanation about why the job is remote is very important for passing the U.S. H-1B visa interview. All right, so those are some tips about uh, the H-1B interview. We really want you to get prepared for this. Don't want you to get stuck at admin processing, have problems getting your visa, getting to the U.S. to start your job. Please reach out to Argo Visa.